Okay, this is our uh, extension project for our 2024. Uh, what we'll be doing is we'll be sending uh, the light values across to a web page through TCPIP. So if you look at our board over here, look at the OLED screen, the first reading that is shown here, light is something, we'll be sending that value across. Okay, so if you come back across to our web page, we'll be setting our IP address at our header file first. This will be the, the value that we find on the CMD, the command prompt. So let me just configure that. I have to type IP config slash all and my IP address in this case would be hang on here 169 Okay, so with that, when that is done, I just have to debug it. So just give it some time while it's debugging. Just give it some time. It should be quite fast. But while it's debugging, maybe I just explain to you some uh, extension, other extension that we did. Um, we configured for this board. Um, we, to start the program, we actually have to turn this rotary switch, which will display the LED, LED over here. And once it reaches 9, it will start the whole system. And also, if you look at the joystick here, we configured it to generate in two types of interrupt. One interrupt is when I hit it to the left and one to the right. And what that will happen is that it will control the, the UART terminal to either send or not to send. So, okay. If you look back at the screen here, okay, I just have to press play. Let me just show you our Terra terminal first. So now it's sending, and when I hit the... Okay, before I start that, okay, you just come back to the board. I, to start the whole system, I have to make the number 9, and then the system starts. And when it starts, the Terra term starts sending messages. And if I want to pause, I will just have to hit the joystick to the left, like this. And if I want to continue, I'll hit it to the right. Okay, so now I'll just show you the web page. So what will happen on the Terra term? I mean, on our website is that we'll key in the address, IP address, 166. And give it some time. And this is the value that of the light temperature on the web page. Yeah, so if I have to cover the light a bit, the value will update. It'll take a while to update. But yeah, it's updated already, like this. So, yeah, that's basically our enhancement. So, sending data to TCPIP. Thank you.